The United Colonies is where you'll find New Atlantis, the first major human settlement in space. The people who live here value law, discipline, and the legacy of humanity. They consider themselves the true children of Earth. You ever think of joining up with the Vanguard? Help the United Colonies even get your UC citizenship? New Atlantis isn't the only city within the United Colonies. The city of Sidonia on Mars to this day serves as the largest mining facility for the United Eleven Colonies. Eleven hours for that incident. It's gonna go Beyond to zero. the United Colonies reach, you might find yourself in a much more wild and independent coalition of star systems. This is Freestar Collective Space. Oh, oh, getting Fallout the vibes. The capital of the Freestar Collective is Aquila City. The Stone Root Inn is an Aquila City fixture. A ranger relies on judgment and intuition to do what's best for the people. Neon started out as a fishing platform but is now known throughout the settled systems as a pleasure city where almost anything goes. If you've got morality issues, this definitely isn't the job for you. Ryujin is hiring the best and brightest of today for our future tomorrow. Everyone has been chewed up and ground up by Neon. Try not to get yourself killed, all right? Outside the bounds of civilized space, there are still plenty of unclaimed systems to explore, but these areas are also home to the most hostile factions in the galaxy. The great serpent hungers. All heathens shall be made dust in time. A new face. This is the face of a brave runner here to challenge the Red Mile. They think the galaxy is theirs. They are wrong. It belongs to the Crimson Fleet. It always has. In Starfield, we're pushing our cities and settlements further than we ever have before. It's all there, waiting for you. A slice of humanity's future. So, ready to get out there? I am. More importantly, so is my Series X. Throughout the galaxy, there are so many things to see and stories to experience. 